Hey boys, welcome to Mass Games, my name is Simon. Today we're looking at the Faceless Amusement Park. This is the follow-up game to the Faithless. In this particular game, what we're looking to do is crucially work cooperatively with a magnet and an aura hat who's gonna come out and we're trying to win and find a couple of memories set up as a two-player game. So in this particular game, we have got eight different amusement park attractions. And what we're looking to do in this particular game is we've got five different monsters visible. So move the aura hat five positions. And as you can see, the compass position has changed. On your turn, you can take two actions. In this case, the aura hat is pointing the compass over here, which allows me to fight off a monster. And I can take a second action. Everybody takes two actions on their turn. I can do a search action. So, search action is important because it helps you win the game. It allows you to draw cards if they're every five and six roll. I haven't rolled two. So I draw one card, two card, and I happen to reveal the card I want in this instance, which in this case happens to be a memory. So it happens to be a memory, in this case, for location one. So location one is over here, and what I need to be doing is getting my teammate to find this memory too. Two ways for that to happen. I can either meet up with this person, and then they've now got this memory, or the walkie-talkie action, which can come out in the game too. Just to let you know, there are numerous rounds in this game, and for every round there's an event. But right now, just to say we've met up, now we are going to come out onto the board ourselves, and the magnet has now changed positions. Now normally this magnet is covered, so you do not know what you're about to discover, so I recommend turning it off when we get to it. But now it's very hard to find that search action. So now we need to be doing more stuff to allow us to take a secondary search action to find another one of those memory locations. That is the crux of the game. If there are any questions, let me know in the comments are best on YouTube. Like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and check out my various playlists, such as the Mass Games playlist, the Family Rate playlist, I've had a setup play and review list amongst many others, including dice distancing, see how far dice roll and whether or not I need a dice tray. Obviously, head through to Linktree as well and also Patreon to support the channel. And via Linktree, there are occasionally competitions, but are time sensitive to disappear. And via Instagram, please follow along there and join the discussion over on Facebook. Listen to the podcast, but for now, back to the table.